second cup of coffee by now. The time, 551. Weather Authority meteorologist Mike Brookins out on the weather deck this morning. Mikey B, good morning to you. Um, hey. We also have a weather alert this morning. We do. We are concerned with the lake effect snow, and it's about time, right? Hardly any snow around central New York. We've got heavy lake effect localized snow that's going to be forming already. Some warnings and advisories east of Lake Ontario. Not only will we see it there, but eventually southeast of the lake. We'll go over the timing on that. We'll go over the seven day one day where we don't get much higher than 10 for our high temperature. So winter fans hold on today, though, is the pick day on my seven day. It's the warmest with the January thought. It's dry, so no road impact today. It is breezy this morning. We will get some rain and snow showers this evening with a cold front. Very minor, if any, accumulation of snow and then that impactful snow overnight tonight far to the north of Onondaga County. And then by tomorrow afternoon, we'll show you yellow here because part of us gets impacted. I think tomorrow afternoon and evening this starts to go into central Oswego County and eventually southern Oswego County southeast of Lake Ontario for most of central New York, although it's lighter. This is when all of us will be dealing with some form or fashion of snow, snow showers or flurries. Right now we're all dry. We have a breeze that's going to ease up a little bit this afternoon as this warm front goes to the north and we top out at 43 degrees. Soak it up. It's going to be changing with this cold front, some rain and snow showers, then the cold air comes in behind it. An all important wind direction will be showing you the future cast where that lake effect snow fires up and where it goes as we go through the next two to three days. So here's our future cast and we'll time it out. Some partial sunshine, not a beautiful day. I and mean, we have a brisk breeze still this afternoon, but 43 degrees with partial sun eventually turning overcast. We first start to get those showers north northwest of Onondaga County late in the afternoon and then the evening here, rain and snow going over to snow, a coating, a trace of snow around Syracuse. Now, on some of the hills southeast and east of Onondaga County, we may get a coating to an inch. I can deal with that, right? Now, the roads are going to become snow covered up east of Lake Ontario. Towards midnight, it develops, and this is going to be heavy at times by morning, mostly up around Watertown, Jefferson, Lewis, and as well, extreme northern Oswego County, northeastern Oswego County. It's due east of the lake tomorrow. So, central, southern Oswego County, you're fine still. Same with us. Now, there will be a trace to an inch tomorrow with snow showers coming in off of Lake Erie, west of Onondaga County. That goes to the south, and so does this. This starts to move into southern Oswego County tomorrow evening, and then southeast of the lake towards Friday. So here's the snowfall projection map tonight through the 6 p.m. period tomorrow. Trace to an inch Onondaga and surrounding counties up into central and southern Oswego County. Then it ramps up dramatically to northern Oswego County. We're talking here north of Pulaski, six or more inches of snow and then up on the Tug Hill, especially in Jefferson and Lewis County. So this is the northern Tug Hill. 12 to 18 inches of snow. And there's going to be more in Oswego County tomorrow night and maybe two to four inches around Syracuse for Friday. So 43, partly sunny with evening wet snow and rain showers. Breezy this morning and then turning windy tonight. So that'll blow and drift the snow up east of Lake Ontario. Tonight's low 27, doesn't rise much. It's colder tomorrow. Lake effect snow up north or east of the lake. And then even colder. Take away another 10 degrees for Friday with lake effect snow coming in. Clouds, snow, snow showers. By Saturday morning, it's just flurries and near the single digits. 30 degrees Saturday, turning mostly sunny. A wintry mix there on Sunday. A little bit milder briefly. More lake effect snow develops behind that system. 10 the high on Tuesday. Back inside.